Yes, my fans, it is your boy Bunny again, coming to have a little talk with you, my fans. But as I always say, my fans, remember, if it's your first time on the channel, don't forget to like, share, comment, and subscribe to the channel. And also hit the notification bell, and you don't miss any video that goes up. Yes, my fans, so like and share comment and subscribe to the channel okay all right what am i talking about today my fans the all of this video gonna be based on saint thomas yes why because saint thomas is where me born and grew up and that's where me know more in a jamaica and personally i'm telling you i am happy i am pleased i am proud this is what I'm seeing on YouTube in Jamaica, St. Thomas, taking place. Yes, this is a brand new road. I run from Harborview. I go all the way around to Portland and all the way up into Cedar Valley. Cedar Valley is where me come from. And I'm telling you, my fans, I was in Jamaica. I was in Jamaica four years ago. I was in Jamaica. And I tell you, my fans, it take me two and a half hour to drive from Marant Bay to go Mangaroa. Yes, two and a half hour. I did stop at Seafood just for five minutes, but that no mean much. So what I'm saying, me in the UK, and I look back at Jamaica and see what I take place, me happy and me proud. So I'm telling you, my fans, I'm just waiting. For the road to open for me to come down, come get a drive on it. But my fans, my viewers, my subscriber, one, your brother, your sister, your nephew, your niece, your uncle, your cousin, your whole generation, tell them, take time drive on the road. Because Mr. One Chuck turn over from the brand new piece of road. Or whoop in a grand spin. You tell me. It's a 30 mile on the road. But yet still. Me see a truck on the side. We can see right up underneath it. The four wheel. I look for me. What's going on? Then me here say. A car. Run off of the road. Down a coal lot on the street. Not coal, sorry. Surge Island. On the street. What's going on? Are you lot so crazy? And because you just were driving on the bad rocky road for so long, you see one little piece of smooth road now and your things are alright. You know what? I'm going to test my car. I'm going to test my bike. I'm going to test my truck. Come on, my bar. Come on, my fans, man. I don't, I don't do better than that, man. You know? I appreciate what I get. You know? Me also say, then sign the contract for the brand new Marant beer for open up. Me happy for the people them at St. Thomas. Me happy, happy, happy for the people at St. Thomas. So, I want to say a big, big, big respect to the people them who are do the work and do it good. That's it last long. So, let me go up in the in in way I come from now. I see the valley I come from. And the last video, what me see, I want to say big up to all the YouTuber who in a Jamaica we highlight the road improvement. Big up. When we say big up, I mean big up to everyone of the YouTuber who are highlight the road works that are taking place from Harverview right to Marant Bay and hop into Cedar Valley. Don't get me wrong, even around the Portland. Big respect, but I'm talking about from Harborview to Marant Bay and up into Cedar Valley. Because these are where my, me come from and these are the roads we me intend to use when we come out. And when we see where I go on, me proud, me happy, and me pleased. So again, to every one of the YouTuber who literally going out there and put up their drone or use their car and drive to show we in the UK how the improvement 
of the roadwork is taking place again i'm saying big up to you thumbs up to you again to take your time to show us in the uk the improvement of the roadworks okay all right so as i said the last video i saw is the one from cedar valley going back down wish i'm happy yeah so anyway enough of that so what i want to talk about is my liquid district you know as i said i born and grew up in a cedar valley area there i went to cedar valley school and a lot of people know me and a lot of people don't know me so i want to say big up to every person of a cedar valley side big up from what you call it from new monk land all of the cedar valley grove mango road nest castle gap all of them surrounded here already i want to say big up to every person wherever you is whether you're in uk in america canada wherever you are in the world and you watch the video and you come from saint Thomas, over cedar valley side big up to you and if you're not yet see what will take place in our own liquid community go up on youtube and type in saint Thomas redevelopment in a youtube and i'm telling you you will see everything we are going up there i just type in saint Thomas woodwork yes because sometimes i'll be typing it's just saint Thomas woodwork and we get everything come up everybody channel come up yeah so as i said my viewers my new viewers just who just watching and never yet subscribe it's time for you to subscribe to the channel now yeah so i want to say big up to every young people up uh cedar valley grove Bethel, mangaro gap because a lot of the hell that them when we know die out and gone and they have younger people out there now at coming up and i was in jamaica four years ago and when i was at mangaro i meet some young guys up there and they were talking to me and them said they know me but some of them i don't know them and it might come in like say because me leave jamaica for a long time and come back me I pretend like me don't know these guys but no i'm telling you i know so because if you live in jamaica now and you is 25 year old that mean when you when me leave jamaica you was only two year old or three or four year old so no me not recognize you yes if you even if you hear me in the 20s I me leave Jamaica 27 years when me leave Jamaica you're a baby yeah so me probably don't remember you yeah so if I come to Jamaica and I meet someone and them say they know me I say I don't remember you and don't insult me I insult you my fans or my friends it's just because I leave Jamaica 27 years now and if I leave Jamaica when you was five or six year old, it would have hard for me to remember you now. So that is what it is. So, but no, no disrespect to you, my fans. So what I'm saying, a lot of young people coming up in the district now, and I appreciate to see what I'm doing in the district. Places where we come up, I may never see any house. We see house there now, which I can see development taking place. And now we're getting good road coming up to see that body now we can see some weird things gonna take place again and i pray that them fix the road through landway as well because landway was my regular route so i used to drive the morning star bus from this castle to town through landway and them time in the road it was they were properly good it was properly good and i'm saying it was 100 percent but it was properly good them time there you know so Let's talk about the wool ahead them will die out. You know, if I was to go back from Bethel going up into my district and just to name a few people who I'm familiar with, like I could say 
Miss Bernita and Miss Albert, they're gone. Miss, we have um, Miss P, who did at the shop, they're gone. You know, I know I'm gonna miss some people, but I'm talking about people who I'm familiar, really familiar with. You know, we have Uncle over on the flat there. You know, we have my Siri, I miss Vadney them. Yeah, all them people, they're then gone. Yeah, there's more other people out there. Fiti and all them man, they're gone. You know, and you know, you come up further, you have my mum, my ma Sultan, they're gone. Papi Spence, sister and Rye, you know, all them people are gone. Uncle Wilburn, mm, Mas Kenneth, Miss Mamsel, Mas Ricky, Mommy, Beverly, all these people are people we're well familiar with. Well, well familiar with. Miss Mama Bull, yeah, Mas Chiny, Miss Larry, the whole of these people, I don't know. I don't know if Miss Larry is still around or, you know, but Miss Greetel, yeah, all these people, dad and aunt, all of these people coming up the hill, with a Perry, Cuckoo, yeah, man, the whole of these people are people that we can call their name right through, yeah, right through, Cooley Burke, yeah, all these people are people that we know from a little pit now come up. Yeah, with all these people, they just gone. You no, know, they just gone. Miss Mama Kelly, Mars Freddy, Papa Son. Yeah, man. And Virus, Mars Rye. Yeah. The whole of these people, I, I, I tell you, Baba and Francis. I can't just name out names, 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 names. And all these people, they just gone, Mars Boise. Yeah. Come on, Miss Fanny, Mars Ten. All these people. Lord, let me listen, man. That district was a big district, you know. Big Mangoro district was a big district. Yeah. We said now. Nah. Son Bentley, Miss Mavis, Massman, Miss Delete. I can just name, name, name right through. Right through. Right through. This is how this district was. And let me tell you something. It's, it's happened that we live in the UK now. And we take this thing for granted. I can sit here and I can name out so much names. Just some betel. Up there so. And I live in a UK here. And a little piece of road where I live on. Not even a good tree tree in a road. And I can't tell you tree is my name on the road where I where live. Because England and like Jamaica, Jamaica, you know everybody in your community. In England, you can't even meet somebody on the road and just talk to them normally because you abuse them. I was like, you know, you, you, you can't just meet somebody on the road and say, hello. It's like, no, that's not allow. That's not allow in the UK. You know, if you just see somebody and say to them, say, oh, you look nice. Then take it to another level of your mind shop, you end up in a courthouse feet. This is how the UK run. This is how the UK run. Pick the people in the UK where you can meet by the road and talk to. And not, not come out of it. You see somebody on the road and say, hello. And then literally, literally just walk past you like, eh? Trust me, you're walking down the street and you meet somebody coming up and you say hello. And then we'll let street and walk past you like, I saw it go. I never the cool hour. But I saw it run here, boss. But again, you can't blame the people them. Because you have these men out there where I grab up people, girl, pick me. And people boy pick me and throw them at the back of van and go and go and do whatever they have to do with them. So at the same time, we have to be careful because people is funny. But you know, this is not about the UK. This video is about St. Thomas and the development that taking place in St. Thomas. When I look back into the Bulbia area, going out seven miles, going out to Grand Spain, 
and I see some houses we have put up in the hills there. When we did Jamaica, all me know one of them places bush, woods, bush. But new road are cut, development that take place, I'm happy for the people of St. Thomas. And as I said already, I can't wait for the road work to complete that me get to come back down. Yeah. To be honest and truthfully, me have no intention to come back to live. And that is the truth. But me want to come on holiday. Come enjoy the country. Yeah. Come on holiday and enjoy the country. So, big up to every person who go home and set up themselves and relax. So, as again me said, my fans, thank you for taking the time to watch this video. Don't forget to like, share, comment, subscribe to the channel because this video is all about St. Thomas, Jamaica. Big up St. Thomas, Jamaica. One love to you. One love to all the people. Stay safe. Stay safe. Stay safe. And be blessed. And remember, my fans, God love you. Stay blessed. Always. I'm out.